Hi everyone, it's Rhonda, and I'm coming to you live to show you how to use a paper clip to put on a bracelet. Now I have two paper clips here. I have a metal paper clip and I have the plastic um, covered paper clip. And the reason I want to do this today is because I saw somebody else do this. I saw the um, <clears throat> the workings to do this and I was kind of intrigued. So we're going to use this bracelet right here. We're going to use five different bracelet types. We're going to use this, this nice little string bracelet with wording on it. So I will tell you this, if you're right handed, your lobster claw class has to be to your right. If you're left handed, then your lobster claw class has to be to your left. Because I tried to do it both ways and since I'm right handed, it was easier to use the lobster claw class on, my, on the right side. So you're going to take one, either or of your paper clips, put it further up from where you want the tension of the bracelet to be. You take the um, paper clip, you wrap it around your wrist, you find the lobster claw clasp while your arm is still on the table, and you put the lobster claw clasp at the tension. And voila! You have your bracelet on your wrist. I want to use several different types of bracelets to show you exactly how easy this can be. I just thought this was the most fascinating thing ever when I saw it. So, we're going to try this one right here. This is a different type of bracelet as you can see. It moves around a lot and you always want to make, you probably would like to make sure that this bracelet is like straight like this. So it's not crooked when you put on, when you put it on. I will say you need to have a flat surface. Put your arm here. Grab this up from the tension where you would like um, the lobster claw class to go. Is that in there? Yes, it is. You put, you use the longest part of the paper clip. You grab it with your ring finger. Find the lobster claw clasp. Open up the lobster claw clasp. And this one moves around a lot, so you see exactly how it goes. This is the most fascinating thing ever to me, especially when I'm using my paparazzi um, jewelry to make a demonstration. So as you see, this one right here is one that has, it's a two-stranded bracelet. So once again, you want to make sure you lay it on a flat surface. You take the paper clip, whichever one you decide to use, you use the smallest end. Grasp that like you put it through there. You bring it around your wrist. You can grasp it with your ring finger. Grasp the lobster claw clasp. Make sure your arm stays on the base of the um And then you put it at the tension that you require. Take this off. And it's on. No difficulties whatsoever. This is very easy when you're this is very useful when for when you're in a rush. And you're just like, oh my god, I don't have anybody around to help me. The next one I want to show you is a double, a triple stranded bracelet. Okay. And as you can see, this one is a little bit shorter than the ones I have been using. So I'm going to make the tension to this one a little bit closer away. So you put it through the, um, the chain 
you grasp it with your middle finger, with your ring finger or your middle finger. You put it right there, you put it through the chain. And I know this is like a simple trick that everybody probably uses, but I just wanted to demonstrate to you exactly how um, to go about doing this. Just in case you're just like, okay. But like I said, if you're right-handed, you're to make sure that the clasp is coming towards you and that the, the strand is away from you. And then you take it and you just place this through there, you wrap it around, oops, you wrap it around, you grasp, <laughs> you grasp it with your middle or your ring finger, you locate your lobster claw clasp, and voila. right there and the last one I want to show you is just a nice little black one <laughs> again find your make sure that the lost clock class if you're right-handed is coming towards you you put it at the tension that you like you take it off and it's on. I thank you for joining me this evening. If you need anything else, I really appreciate you can always talk to me. Send me a DM. This is Rhonda's Paparazzi Jewelry, and I thank you very much for coming. Bye.